You know when you have some headaches, your hands start to shake, and you can't stop looking at the screen? Yeah, you got the POC virus. <laughs> And today I'm gonna jump into a new proof of concept. Calm down, I'm not, I'm not abandon Terminal GPT. I'm gonna go back to it. But I have this idea and I have to go forward with this proof of concept before I forgot about it and I, I really wanted to do it because it's something that I wanted to give back to a community that helped me a lot during my journey as an expat. So I'm gonna show you guys uh, a group here that's called IT in Dublin. IT in Dublin is a Brazilian meetup where we gather every Saturday, every last Saturday of the month, and we do networking. We do uh, we share job vacancies. We have we have like some sort of like a mentorship where we help people on how to approach uh, recruiters and HRs and the way that they do interviews. And uh, we've been helping a lot of people there, and it's been fantastic to see how it's been going. And this group has been running for 10 years. The meetups has been running for seven years. And I believe now this group has expanded to other channels. So we have Facebook, we have Discord, we have WhatsApp group. And of course, for other, other places, we have IT Malta now, we have IT Cork, IT Galway. So in some sense, uh, it, the, the group has federated a little bit, but we don't have any specific central place where we can gather the information where we can find this group. So. What I want to do today, I want to do a land, landing page, but a little bit different. So I'm going to show you on my mind map here. So the idea is very simple. I'm going to show a hero page on my landing page. I'm going to show partners. I'm going to show other, other groups and other events. So one of the ideas I wanted to do is create a, a small page where they is going to do an authentication. And uh, I think about like GitHub or LinkedIn or something like that. I don't want to do like something very fancy. And here we're going to have a little actually, social voting and <laughs> where the user is going to be able to add their, their, other, their other groups that they, might, they think they might fit to this landing page. And during, I don't know, one week or 24 hours, people are going to be upvoting and downvoting the, 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 the channels. And at the end of the timeline, the channels who wins is going to be added here on this website. So it's a little bit fun idea. And for that, I'm going to use uh, Fresh.js. So Fresh.js is a landing page, uh, is a web framework using Dino. So Dino is a, is a, run, is a JavaScript runtime uh, made by the, I believe it's the guy who created Node.js and uh, Dino Fresh.js is a web framework where you can just do a run, just in time rendering, you can do island based client hydration, you can do a zero runtime overhead. So it seems like it's very easy to configure as easy start. Of course, going to be using Tailwind CSS as well for that. And uh, yeah, I'm going to try to run first the landing page and uh, create a landing page. And then after that, I come back to you and see what's going to happen. All right. So it's pretty much it. And uh, I'm going to start coding and then I, I share with you what I've achieved today. All right. So yeah. All right, I, I, I finished off half of the skeleton of the, of the landing page. I'm going to show you guys. It's, it's kind of weird at the moment because there's a lot of design to do yet. So I, I don't, I'm doing the design while I'm working on the project. So one of the takeaway, a key takeaways I got it was to work with Press.js was pretty interesting because it is kind of like Next.js. So for example, I can show you here the the way that the components work or uh, maybe the document I, I want the documentation sorry and uh, the documentation here show here for example the interactive islands is something that's interesting because it's only when your component is an island it's uh, 
where next flash js enables client side connectivity that's pretty interesting to see and uh, i'm going to be playing out of this after and i thought i i start creating the the components here but uh, as they are static i don't need to do it so i'm going to move them to components and they're going to be static components Mm, and uh yeah the dynamic roots is gonna play out pretty nice as well it's like next.js so it's not difficult to to work with as well um, uh, handling fetched data that's gonna this is gonna be important because i wanted to show on the it in dublin the number of the members and they're gonna capture this from the facebook page so basically what what i want to do is just create a small poop tier that's go there into the the facebook page and capture the number of members that is in there and uh yeah so partners here uh, this card i was just testing out so this card is going to be moving here i'm going to get in the logos from the partners going to lay out the partners here and here i'm going to put the cards with the other communities and as well events and after I finish this, I'm gonna start working on the authentication to do the second page. And then the second page, I wanted to create this, uh, this voting for adding communities on the main page. All right, so that's pretty much it. Um, sorry, sorry, I don't have much to show today. And of course, this is a work in progress. I'm gonna put the link of this project concept on the description as well because it's going to be open source too. I I just wanted to show like how I'm trying to play it out, how I'm trying to build this stuff. And uh, if you want to work with and going to see how Dean works and how fast it is, I found it's pretty fast and uh, it's it's built on top of Rust as well. And I like Rust as well, a lot. So that's it. And uh, see you guys next.